Does bouncing on a trampoline or rebounding support your body's ability to repair? Let's talk about it. Bouncing on a trampoline or rebounding will, to begin with, stimulate blood circulation. So in your legs, so it's going to really help overall blood circulation. There is a hypothesis out there. I'm not aware that it has ever been quantified. But when you have an impact on your bones, it does support the release of stem cells from the bone marrow. It's very interesting to note that when studies have been done on people who got bone marrow transplant, like after leukemia, for example, the recovery is much faster and much stronger when people do bounce on trampoline. So there's a clear indication here that the whole recovery of hematopoietic function, the ability to make your own blood, uh, is much better when a patient is bouncing on a trampoline. It's also going to do something that is, I think, um, under discussed, if you want, in our modern world, which is the fact that your body posture, your own ability to face the world is based on your posture, which is based on the proprioceptive function of your foot. Uh, you're supposed to feel the, the, the distribution of gravity and distribution of weight on your feet. Uh, we grew up over tens of thousands of, of years walking barefoot out there and feeling everything under our, the sole of our feet. But we no longer do this because we have shoes that have insoles, that are cushioned. So it's almost like the proprioception of the feet are completely numb. And it has a lot of impact on our posture and overall health. So bouncing on your feet reawakens that feet, that, 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 that part of your feet that is going to also have a huge impact on your health. So yes, if you have a chance to bounce on a trampoline, do it. It's good for your stem cells and for a lot of other things. In your